fitness angel. We're gonna work our core today. So if you have a stability ball, grab it. If you wanna just use the mat, you can do these things on the mat. But we're gonna start out sitting on the ball. I like the ball because it helps you to work on your balance, which engages your core naturally. So I want you to roll those shoulders back. Give me a couple of rolls. I want you to hold your shoulders back and down. Your chest is up. Now pull the abs in because remember, success starts in your mind. So think about the muscles we're working. All right, take those arms out and we're just gonna tap the sides. Good job. Now take a deep breath with your nose. Blow it out, reach over, feel that stretch. Take a deep breath. Blow it out. Take it up. Hands back, again, roll those shoulders. I want you to really think about your core. Keep the shoulders back and down. Good job, are you ready? We're gonna, I'm gonna turn so you can see me, but again, if you wanna get on the ball, I mean on the mat, get on the mat. All right, guys, we're gonna start here. I want you to really feel that nice stretch. That should feel really good. And you know the ball is in the middle of your back, if you can stretch over like that, okay? Now I want you to pull it up, pull those abs in. Think about the muscles we're working. We're gonna take the hands back, take it up and down. Up and down. That's it. Now hold it here and we're just gonna go to the sides. To the sides. That's it. I'm barefoot so I can grip. <laughs> you don't wanna slide around. Now back to the center. That's it. Really focus on using the core. Breathe. To the knee, side to side. That's it. Back to the center. Straight up. To the corners. We got this. Give me four more. Now take those arms out nice and long. Take it up and back. Up and back. Now take those hands back. Just pulse it. Pulse, pulse, pulse. Slow it down. Take it up and down. We got this. To the corners, reach. To the front, take it up. Last one, good job guys. You should feel nice and warm and feel that nice stretch. Now put your hands on the ball and then you're gonna carefully bring it up. All right guys, now I'm gonna take it to the mat. And I'm gonna get on my knees, tummy on the ball, and I'm gonna walk it out. I think I'm losing my ponytail here. Okay, <laughs> walk it out. Good job. So I want you to lift those legs up, pull your abs in. That's it, we're gonna take it down and up, and up, down and up. So hold your core in, this is great for your lower back as well. Woo, yes. Right around that waistline. Up and up. Keep your belly button pulled in, that's it. Yes, we got this. Now hold it up and pulse it. Pulse and pulse, you got it. Keep going, keep your glutes tight. This is great for the lower back. Yes, four more, which is all part of your core. All right, we're gonna take it down, roll it back. Good job, guys. Now I'm gonna put my elbows on the ball. Okay, roll it out and in. It's kinda like those ab roller machines, if you see them. The more you do it, the more you're gonna feel the abdominals. That's it. Breathe. Now if you can, I want you to lift your legs into a plank. You're not laying on the ball. This is what I see some people do. We're not doing that. You're lifting it up. Feel the difference? 
Hold it here, you got it. Hold it here, give me four more. Last one, good job, take it down. We're gonna roll it out again, are you ready? Roll it out. Woo! Good job, take your toes down. You should be able to touch that floor with your toes. Up. Good job, if you're on your mat, you're just doing planks and you can lift one leg at a time. That's it. Woo, come on, give me four more, we got this. Three, two, now hold it up and pulse it. Pulse, 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 pulse. Four more, you got it. Last one, now take it off, roll it back, elbows on again. We're gonna do one more set of these, are you ready? Take it out and in, out and in. Think about your abdominals, keep them tight. Last one, lift it up, hold it here, we got this. Keep the belly in, squeeze your glutes. Eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, last one. Awesome, y'all stretch it out, that should feel good. All right, we're gonna do another song with the ball, if you have it, but again, if you don't wanna use the ball, you don't have to. Okay, I'm gonna take it to my back. I'm gonna get the ball. Awesome, between my feet. All right. Now, I like to put my hands under my lower back for back support. If you have a towel, you can do that too. Now, you're gonna hold the ball tight so you don't let it fall out, okay? That's gonna engage your, your inner thighs as well. Okay, so we're gonna take it down and up. Here we go. Up and down. Think about those lower abs, right below the belly button. You could do this without the ball as well. Woo, yes, it feels good, come on. Up and down. Up and down. You got this, two more. Up. Now we're gonna hold it down. Put the ball down and put your feet on top of that ball. And I want you to lift your hips so you're making a bridge. So if you have little kids at home or grandkids, they can run under you, right? <laughs> All right, so you wanna pull the lower abs in and squeeze those glutes. Take those arms up, shoulders are down. Really pull and engage your core. You gotta think about it, hold it here, yes. Belly button to spine. Now we're gonna take those hips down and up. Your arms are just here for stability. Squeeze at the top, that's it. Squeeze at the top, you got it. Last one. Now we're gonna start from the beginning, grab it between your feet, bring it up. Remember, have a nice firm grip, hands under those hips, you got it. Let's just hold it here, just take it side to side. I want you to feel the abs, squeeze. Think about the muscles, squeeze. Now work your legs down, and I want you to hold it halfway down. Yes, halfway down, you got it. Give me eight more, eight, seven, six, come on. Four more, pull the abs in. We gotta train those muscles. Now we're gonna take it down and then back up. Here we go. Down and up, all the way. Good. Belly's pulled in, we got this. Give me four more. Four. Breathe. Three. Breathe. Two. Breathe. Last one. Good job. Now take it down, put your feet on top. Woo, back to that bridge, lift those hips up. Shoulders are down, abs are in. Take those arms up. If you feel more comfortable putting them down, if you don't quite have your balance there, that's okay. If you can, then we're gonna lift. And then we're gonna add the hips, yes. Down and up. Woo, that feels good, right? 
Another challenge is to take the arms down and up. Feel that lengthening of the spine. Yes. Now hold it up, hold it. Four, three, two, last one. Get that ball, let's do one more set. We're almost to the end of the song. Hold the ball nice and tight. Take it down, two counts. Here we go, down and up. Down and up, a couple more. Then we'll do a nice stretch. Good job. Yes. Last one, you got it. All right, take that ball, rock it up. Woo, I hope you enjoyed that. Sit it up nice and tall, let's stretch it out. Some days we just don't take enough time to stretch, but that's very important to help you reduce chances of falling, of getting hurt, of getting injured. Let's roll those shoulders back. Good job, guys. Roll it back. Take that ear down. Hopefully winter will be over sooner, not later, so I can get back outside. I love doing my workouts outside. Take a deep breath with your nose. Exhale. And I know some of you enjoy working out with me outside in the sunshine. Good job. I want you to curl your back. Ah, curl like a cat. Take a deep breath up. Blow it out. Now take those hands behind you and open it up. Stretch it out. Yes. Good job. Let's take it to our hands and knees. Stretch out that back a little bit. I want you to curl like a cat and arch. Yes. Do it again. Curl. And arch. Oh, let's do one more. This feels good. Pull your abs in. And arch. Good job, guys. Thank you for joining me. Please follow my page. Do more of my workout.